it is very difficult to, to uh, segment the label from CT data. Uh, first of all, it is difficult to find uh, an optimal threshold range to separate the label from surrounding structures. When I set threshold, uh, I'm not expecting to cover every pixel of the label, but rather to generate uh, a dense red uh, dots cloud on top of the label area. There might be holes, but we are going to use uh, uh, curvature to go over that. It is easy to set uh, the seed region, um, but uh, there are some area of labor might cause leakage. First of all, uh, the big winds, uh, the Wanakawa and uh, the portal wind, we definitely want to put some blocker uh, to prevent the leakage from that area. Uh, and then the heart, uh, the myocardia almost have the same uh, density as the labor and they are very close to each other, so here we manually put a, a blocker on top of the heart. And then uh, the other end of the one color. Uh, here we are going to use a very high uh, smoothing factor to uh, go over the small holes inside the, the uh, label mask and also to prevent the region uh, leak to uh, nearby uh, structures like stomach. Um, well, while recording this video, the software become very slow, uh, but in a normal case, it takes about uh, two minutes to segment the label from uh, normal size data. Uh, the data size I'm using now is uh, 500 by 500 by 200 size, so it's quite a big data set. So this is the segment results. Uh, there are some uh, cysts on top of the lever um, that is not uh, caused by error. Well, thank you for watching.